As every school child knows these days, money doesn't grow on trees, it comes from vending machines. Today, the ubiquitous automated teller machine was inducted by the Smithsonian Institution as a, quote, historic step in the evolution of society, unquote. Don Wetzel was honored as the proud father of the modern day ATM. I was in the teller line one day, Bill, uh, wanting to cash a check to get some money. And the line was long, it wasn't moving, and I was getting more irritated by the minute. And it dawned on me, there's, there's gotta be a better way of doing this. Irritation, too, is a mother of invention. Good morning. Good morning. History tells us there were once teller humans. Thank you, Mr. Jackson. How odd. But human tellers went home at 3 p.m., didn't come in on Saturdays, and they refused to stand on street corners holding big wads of cash. Something thousands of ATMs do 24 hours a day around the world. The whole concept of electronic transactions is, is a major change in our culture, and we like instant gratification. Believe it or not, this is the 30th anniversary of the first ATM. But then it didn't catch on right away. Our machine was just a big silver uh, monster almost. Uh, and that's one of the things we had to overcome is get people to be comfortable walking up to it. Today, more than 70% of Americans have an ATM access card. This is the guy who invented the ATM. Oh. <laughs> and I hope you like it. Uh, usually, except when I'm held up at gunpoint. Okay, there have been a few problems. The desperados dashed out of the bank, climbed into waiting automobiles. In the old days, bank robbers robbed the bank. Today, they rob us. And a few folks with access to heavy equipment have been known to withdraw whole machines. And there are smaller problems like ATM etiquette. When someone decides to do their entire household's banking by machine, it really drives you crazy. There are a few diehards, of course, technophobes, people who need people. Do you prefer this to a uh, dealing with a teller? No. I continue to like human contact when I'm dealing with money. Do you use uh, ATMs? Uh, no. Well, as a matter of fact, my wife has never used an ATM. Last year, I'm told there were over 8 billion transactions with ATM machines. Do you get a percentage of each one of those transactions? No. <laughs> I wish. Alas, Don Wetzel did not get rich from his machine, but he does have the thanks of a grateful nation. This man invented the ATM. He did? Yes, he did. Bless yeah. you. And a place in history. His machine, now ensconced in the Smithsonian, alongside those of other great inventors, Today, Don Wetzel stands as the Henry Ford of quick cash. Bill Geist, CBS News, Washington.